Hey, Jasper! Hmm? The new Unleash the Archers video drop, man. Check it out. All right, I'm sorry for the light in the background. It's an extremely sunny day today, but I am too excited. I have to record this reaction right now. I've not seen the video. I can't wait. I'm a big Unleash the Archers fan, so um, yeah, let's do this. Bam. I love Napalm Records intro. Already so much nostalgia with this, right? The sound. I'm hearing. Stranger Things, Wonder Woman 1984, a little bit of 80s flair there. Synthwave retro style. I'm, I'm sold. This is a band that always has such good melodies. People complain that their songs sometimes are too long, but I love the, the way they build up their songs. Britney showing his boss from the beginning. Ha <laughs> ha, yo Val. Oh man, Britney Slays is fast becoming my favorite singer. Love the little electric, yeah, effects, nice touch. I mean, this is just a fan pleaser right there. I'm trying to follow the lyrics along, because I do believe this is a concept album and that Britney wrote a book? I ordered, I pre-ordered the book. You can just see these four people in a room going like, let's write a song that is an anthem from the first moment you hear it. Nice number of the beast tattoo there, by the way. So we don't know the story yet of this song. It feels a very uplifting song so far. I love this acting. <laughs> These guys are way too much fun making this video. So far, I find the sound is pretty similar to Apex, which is not a bad thing. It's an amazing album. Her singing and her voice is just so amazing. This is something that I love about Unleash the Archers. There's soul in there. Yes, there's a lot of solos, there's a lot happening, a lot going on, but it's it's not just showing off like how fast I can play, you know, or how crazy I can play. They're fast, 
but it's got a vibe, it's got a soul. Anyone else get a Mean Man Skeletor vibe? I guess it looks like Britney. Yeah, that's simply the other vibe is coming back, sure. I can't believe that was seven minutes. Like, it's just for me typical Unleash the Arch, and that's kind of you know one of the reasons why I like him so much. Is yes, there's a lot going on in their songs, and sometimes you need to catch a breath. But time just flies when they play. Um, a lot of their best songs tend to be you know over seven minutes, and and it just never gets boring, which is which is pretty amazing. So like I said, first flavor of this album, um, similar. I thought this song at least to Apex, definitely a few like synth effects in there. The whole video gives this little, you know, 80s uh, retro future vibe uh, that you see being very popular in synthwave these days. And I think in just in general, you know, pop culture in the last few years has been filled with nostalgia for the 80s. And this definitely is oozing out of this video and this sound. But yeah, I can't wait to, to discover more. I'm very excited to learn more about the story. I love bands that take the time to build a concept album. I'm excited. Uh, Unleash the Arch is, is a band that I love and I would love to see grow bigger. I thought it was amazing to see how their Awakening video really went viral. And also when they covered the Canadian classic uh, Northwest Passage, I thought that was done really well. The band had just embarked on tour when you know the whole lockdown happened, so it was very unfortunate. I do hope that they're not losing out their momentum and that when the lockdown is over and they can tour again that everybody continues to embrace them uh, this is fantastic so uh hey congrats to unleash the archers i'm super excited i can't wait to hear more let's get this album out thank you for watching this video click right here to subscribe to see more content like this and i'll see you soon